Hey, welcome back everybody. Be here with the OntileGameshow.com playing a little bit more of Hitman Absolution. So I just passed the cutscene and I'm moving on with some of the gameplay. So let's continue from where we left off last. So let's tell me noisy and makes it easier for your enemies to spot you. So why would I do it? Is there anything in here for me to collect? We got some guys over there. Those guys are left alive before. So the question is, how am I going to get out of here? I'm not trying to be armed. I was just trying to go into cover. It's not evidence. I'm just looking if there's any more evidence because, you know, as a gamer, I like collectibles like the next guy. Agent 47 can deal with enemies swiftly and with great precision. Note that while you are focusing on your targets, you expend instinct rapidly. Okay, hold Q, press Q to activate shooting. Turn the camera to focus on your enemy, then lock the shot. Fatal damage. Focus on the next enemy. Oh shit. Make sure to deal fatal damage to all four enemies. All enemies are dealt with. Now execute the attack. Oh shit. Damn, they hardly got a chance to take off a shot. Yep. So that's the tagging. I was wondering the menu when I read that. Wait a second, wait a second. I know this is stupid, guys. That is cool. I love when they make little things like this actually interactive in video games. I didn't actually think the physics for this damn thing to work was gonna be there. At all. Thought it was going to be like a stupid lamp in a corner that doesn't move or nothing. Is there anything in here worthy to get a react, react, interact with? After playing so many um, Dead Island and games you can loot, I keep wanting to loot the, loot the bodies. I'm just going to look at this anywhere I can hide the bodies. If there is, I will actually hide the bodies. It probably isn't anywhere over here, but... It actually would help improve my little score at the end. Why not? Because we play games for score. Sometimes that is. Sometimes we play for story in the sense of Bioshock. Damn, that's a good ass game. If you guys haven't played Bioshock Infinite yet? Definitely check it out. And play Bioshock 1 as well. Skip 2 though. It's not that 2 is horrible or anything. It's just, it's not necessary. Oh, it's picking locks. Oh, to stop. Oops, I didn't mean that. At least I don't gotta go in there and do it my damn self. So it looks like V is to actually um. So I'm gonna stop the video, guys, right here, cause like I said.